So, man, let's get to it, though, man. Did y'all see this motherfucking post, bruh? I just seen this, bro. I just seen this post, right? And, and it's like you probably seen it on Instagram. It's like where this it's a story about where this dude was like telling a story about how he had the bottom bunk and he wasn't letting the OG get on the top bunk. And when and and, and the OG talked to him all night, and then finally he let the OG get the top bunk. And then he went to breakfast with the OG and went to the yard. And then he the OG clapped and. 300 Muslims stood up and you know what I'm saying and at attention for him and he walked up to the young man and said if you made me um, Sleep on that top bunk. I was gonna have you killed. Well Nigga in the real world nigga. We all got in the combat box like that niggas mentally deranged If an old man was sweating a little nigga for a sale and was gonna kill him because he had to sleep on the top bunk Some weird shit nigga. That's mentally that's some institutionalized shit. If an old man, he ain't really no, no, he really ain't no religious man. He really ain't no man of God. So, bam. Nigga, we looking through the comments. I'm looking through the comments because a lot of normal people, I'm looking for people to say, man, that shit looks stupid. That sounds stupid. That ain't no real nigga shit. That ain't no God shit. That ain't no power. Nigga, that's a nigga who in power who crazy. And, and, and going through the comments, I see this nigga X-rated make a comment. And he trying to correct him and say, it's not an Amon, it's an Iman. I used to be a religious leader in prayer. I said, bitch, nigga, you the devil. And anybody who know X-rated know he the devil. You know, he's, he got out of jail for killing an old woman, bro. And went right back to trying to be a super crypt. The crypts is, is, is scandalous and evil. X-rated snitch, y'all. He got stabbed on the yard a bunch of times for being arrested. He told on the case and the murder, if you go look up the paperwork. This nigga killed somebody mama because he was scared to deal with their sons who was manning up on shit. He went and got revenge by killing somebody mama. And let me explain everybody why this is so important to sack. It's why everybody bang red, bitch. It's nigga, this, even the good people in the city was like, oh man, fuck these. X rated the reason why his gang don't exist. Nigga, they got. Nigga, they got exterminated. You see what? Hey, nigga.